Hello guys, KP Shamino here with another guide for Louisiana and this time it's going to be a guide for the trophy blue catfish. So the yeah the catfish is yeah not easy to get because he's at a certain place and the main problem was I was fishing on a sunny day for three four days and I was not getting a lot of blue catfish. And I was thinking that it was not that good uh, position, but then I went to a partly cloudy day and that's the place to be. So you guys can see it, one hour and 30 minutes and I got already 75 kilogram of catfish. So let's get started. So you need to go once again to the swampy open space. It's uh, here is the position of the, the flathead unique, but now we're going to fish over here. That's the hole. And I will show you guys how you can figure it out the hole. So you just need to go with like a lure setup with the crankbait. And I will show you guys really quick how you need to do it to find the hole in the game. So I was just throwing from right to left all the way. And what you need to do is you just throw at one position. And then you just drill in. And you will see it on your crankbait that you are going over a hole. So Check my crankbait. Now it's hitting the ground. And check now. It's going up. I hope. No, I'm not in the hole. I'm too far to the right. So that was not a hole. So you guys can see it. It's not a hole. Let's reel back in. So I need to go a little bit to the left. So let's try it again. I was just on the edge because I know there is a hole. So let's go now a little bit to the left of that tree. And trees are always good markers and shadows are always good markers to find your hole back. Because that's very important that you know where you need to throw the next time. So let's go now a little bit to the left and check now. Yeah, here we go. Check. Do you see my crankbait going up? So that means I, I'm now in the hole. And now it stops. So that was 45 meters until 38 meters. And I think I had just a bite. Something was biting. But that's okay. Now you got the hole. But the hole is not only on that tree. If you go now here to the left. You just throw over here. That's a couple of meters more to the left. And you do just the same trick. Just drill in. You will see now it's not in the hole because he's hitting the bottom. And at 47 meters again he goes up. I'm over the uh, yeah hole at the moment. 47. Remember it until 37. So the hole is from that side to that side. It's a very big hole. So that's where you need to throw. So it's not one position. It's like let's say 5 to 6 meters from left to right. But it's always the same. 47 to 40, 38 meters, and then you're okay. So let's do now a throw, uh, a good throw. So what you need to do is now you need to throw in the hole, and we can just throw in the middle, 47 meters. I go with the speed one, and I'm going once again with the three and a half meter 6O crankbait. It works really well. And check now. Now we are over the hole. So just go with the speed one, the same like the flat head catfish. And you are going to get a blue catfish. I'm not sure that they are going to bite. Because I already got a lot of them here. So now it's done. And I never got a blue catfish close to the shore. It's maybe possible that I got bad RNG. But now you can just drill in. So you are not going to catch anything else. I had the trophy white bass. But you are just wasting time. Because you are not in the hole. Okay. So that's the position that you need to be guys. If you are not sure that you are in the hole. You guys can just use the tactic that I used. Then for float fishing. Just the same story. But I saw one major problem. So I was going with my uh, very heavy setup. And that's this one. Yeah, and that was not a very good cast. But I can only throw 43 maximum meters. But I had a lot of trouble to getting a bite. And that's really strange. Because 38 meters is still the hole. So I'm perfectly in the hole. But it didn't work that well. So, yeah, it's strange. I got, I got a trophy, I think, with this setup and this distance. But I think I need to go a little bit further. But the main problem is, at the moment, with this setup, I cannot do it. So... I went with my level 26 setup, 
and my level 26 setup goes a little bit further. So you can use both of them because I got a trophy with this setup too, the level 26. It was 18 kilograms. So you can just throw a little bit further with that. Yeah, a little bit further. It's almost 20 meters further. So what you do is with this setup, that's perfect. You just go a little bit closer. And why is the bobber not coming straight? Ah, he's coming straight because I'm now in the hole. Come on, bobber. Get yourself straight. I think that I'm not far enough to the left. I'm just on the edge of the hole at the moment. But you guys need to watch it because I think I got a bite even at the moment. So that's how you need to do it. You need to get a straight bobber. And yeah, there. It's, it's once again the same bug. But that's how you need to do it, guys. So... Go with the level 26 setup, it works good. I think a lot better because you can throw a little bit further. I think it's very strange because you're still in the hole, but it doesn't work. But uh, for the time zone, guys, I think that the sunny day is a no-go. It's not a good day. It was very bad, in my opinion. Four fish, that was all in the best moments. For a partly cloudy day, I got from 5 to 8. It's a very good uh, time frame for the trophy. I didn't test the afternoon. You guys can do it if you want. And on a, a cloudy day, I didn't test it either. But you guys know the position. You know that you can get here a trophy. So you guys can check out the other time frames. So let's go for the setups now. Uh, a 26 setup, Phoenix 450, Fatboy Spin 5000, Mono 0 0.35. That's only a test of 7.2 kilograms. Hook 7.0. That's the far distance one. And the guys that are level 26, you need to use this one. Shiners work really well. I tried leeches, but I didn't have a lot of success. You guys can go to the map tooltip for the other baits and just put it on your hook. I'm going with the 7-0 hook because there is a lot of other crap fish here around. I got even a chain pickerel on this hook. I don't understand it, but yeah. It's how it is, I cannot do a lot about it. The heavy setup, the Brutus 300, Thunderspin 5500, Mono 0.5, just the same hook, 7.0. The depth is maximum on the two. So just go maximum and you're okay. For the lure setup, the Rivertex Zoys 270, the Thunderspin 5500, Fluoro 0.6 and the crankbait 3.5 meter 6.0. It's the same crankbait. That you can use on the flathead. So uh, it's the very heavy one. It's the 56G one that you can use. And it will work really well. So if you go now to the fish keeper. You see I got four blue catfish today. So that's in the time frame of one hour. One hour and a half. I got two trophies. They give 450 experience. And 2000 currency. I think they give a little bit more currency than the flathead. But I'm not sure. And here you can see it. The, the chain pickerel. 0.6 kilogram. He bites on the 7.0 hook. I got channel catfish too. Sometimes you got the channel catfish. So that was it for the guide guys. You got three setups. If you want to be sure that you get a trophy. 5 to 8 a.m. on a party cloudy day. Don't take sunny days. For the, the cloudy day. You guys need to check it by yourself. And for the afternoon partly cloudy day. You need to check it too. But you don't need to do a lot. I think you can get easily get your uh, net full. With that fish. But it's not as good as the flathead. The flathead got a unique. And it's, uh, the action is a lot higher. So that was it for the blue catfish. Thanks for watching guys. Have fun in Louisiana. I see you guys in the next video. I think I'm going now for the unique bowfin. Because it's one of the easiest uniques that you can get here. So I'm going to check it out. So see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.